people asking you if you're always hungry. People don't know what it really does to you mentally. And honestly, if I wanna be fat, why the hell does it matter to you? But everything changed one night. For those of you who, who know me, who've been following me, you know this story, but for those of you who don't, everything changed this one night when I had had enough. I decided it's time to make a change. It's time uh, to be different. I realized that no one else was gonna save me but myself. And quite frankly, signing up for the gym was probably one of the best things that's ever happened to me. Because when I was overweight, I was at my lowest. I'm gonna be honest. I hated myself, didn't love being overweight, all right? Definitely wasn't something that I was used to. But signing up for that gym, you know, changed my life because it opened a new chapter. It was something that I wasn't really familiar with. It had been a while since I'd been in the gym, so I didn't really remember any of the workouts. But, you know, I got myself in there. I searched up which workouts would help me with what body parts. You know, I just remained consistent. But the gym really changed my life. And this is how. to the gym you build a lot of things but the most important thing that you build is your confidence that's like one of the main things when you're in the gym you know when you don't have confidence you're not going to be uh, good at anything you do you're not going to want to do anything you're just going to stay in that shell and you don't want to you don't want to live your life like that you don't want to be in that shell ever since i hit the gym ever since i made this change i've been a lot more confident not just the way i look but in everything that i do if i want to go apply for a job or if i have a job interview i'm more confident because like yeah you know if you could lose over 50 pounds, if you could lose even 10 pounds, you know, you can do anything. That's a great accomplishment, whether it's 10 pounds, 50 pounds, 73 pounds. Put in that dedication, being consistent, you know, that's something that you should be proud of. That's something that a lot of people can't and probably won't do. So that's one of the most important things, you know, you're gonna realize by going to the gym, your confidence is gonna go through the roof. And keep in mind, it's not you being cocky, all right? It's you being confident. People like to get that all mixed up, but no. There's a big difference between being cocky and being confident, all right? Another great reason why you should go to the gym and you know a factor that gets overlooked a lot is your worth. Your worth goes through the roof when people actually see that you care about yourself because that's one of the messages that it sends out when you actually go to the gym, you take care of your body, you take care of your health because at the end of the day, health is a real wealth. So the respect that I got after I achieved this weight loss was, was ridiculous. Like literally ridiculous. The same people who used to make fun of me are like the first ones telling me congrats now. It's crazy. Um, it's crazy how the world works, but that's just how life is. I personally feel like, and this is probably just me, or may not be just me, but you know, when you're in the gym and you achieve a change to your body, to your weight, it, it brings worth to you because the next person who wants to achieve what you did could easily come to you and ask you, oh, how'd you do it? And then you could easily Put that person on game. You can tell that person what you did. You could assist that person with whatever that person needs. And boom, you just brought value to yourself. Do you know what I'm saying? And being around the fitness world, the fitness atmosphere, oh my God, there's a whole other side of life to being in this fitness realm. The people that you meet in the gym, the network is crazy. There's you know people who got their own you know, clothing line, like myself. The people who you know run their own businesses, a lot of athletes, you never know who you can meet in the gym. This last thing I think is you know probably gonna compete with the first one that I had said earlier, but your lifestyle, you know, going to the gym changed my entire lifestyle because when you're around that environment of people who are you know in the gym working on themselves, you're gonna realize that okay, I gotta start eating healthier now. I gotta start going to bed earlier, or I gotta start waking up earlier. You're going to start taking these things, these steps in your life that will literally just change your lifestyle. Going to the gym and being consistent with the gym built that discipline for me to be consistent with my diet. So now diets, you guys may hear that diets don't work. And I believe that because it needs to be a lifestyle. It can't just be a diet because, you know, you'll do a diet for like a month and you'll just fall right off. So being able to step my foot into the gym and be consistent with the gym literally like pushed over to the kitchen and just made it consistent to eat clean 
I want to say like 90% of the time because you know you should have a little balance you should be able to cheat a little bit but for the most part I live a very healthy lifestyle when it comes to the things that I eat so with all that being said you know if you're contemplating going to the gym you don't want to be consistent or it's hard for you to be consistent think about you know think about the end of the road think about the things that you can accomplish think about how you know it could change your life and just think about all the other factors that gets overlooked you know when you go to the gym because you're not just there to like look good no it does a lot mentally to the body to the human body changes your life and overall i mean there's no uh, going to the gym won't hurt you there's no downside of going to the gym all right you can only go up if you go to the gym now i really hope i motivated any of you guys out there all right if you guys have any questions you guys want to know what i did i have an ebook i'll leave it in the description below everything i did mentally physically emotionally everything i did or went through during my weight loss is in that ebook from the workouts to the diet so check it out if you want to if you need some help if not you know just start be consistent and then you're going to see yourself you know gradually progress so I, I hope you guys enjoyed this video and i hope it motivated anyone watching this i hope it inspired and pushed anyone watching this not only you know just go to the gym but just do something different just push yourself challenge yourself be the better you become the better version of yourself at the end of the day, that's why I started this YouTube channel, was to try to inspire and motivate anyone watching it. So when I leave this earth, I know I did something. But follow me on Instagram, that's one underscore more 97. Follow the apparel page, that's OM97 Apparel. And other than that, make sure you guys subscribe, hit that like button, and stay tuned for more vids. But we are out.